Hey, I'm hungry. Do you want to go get lunch? Aren't you hungry? Uh, yes, you're right. Um, I think we should go. We should go have lunch. What do you think? Yeah, we read enough. Meanwhile, I have a question for you. Oh, yeah, go on. You never told me about your love life. Who is your girl? I, you know, I wasn't interested about love life. I, my main goal was to focus on my education, get my degree, and then always go back to love life. Here now, in the next two weeks, we should be done from school. So I guess I found someone that is dearest to my heart, so. How is that? Is that me? What? I thought we are friends and reading partner and we'll be friends forever. So why would you guess it's you? So who is that lucky one that took you away from me? No one took me away from you, Sunita. We are friends and we're always gonna be friends forever. I mean, in case you really wanna know who I'm talking about, her name is Mariah. No, oh, the doll girl. She's beautiful. Drive a pink jeep and richer than me. Tell me more about her. Enough about this love life. We gotta go. It's lunchtime, okay? I'm not hungry. What? Come on, let's go, Sunita. We are hungry. We need to go eat. Are you jealous? No, I'm just concerned as your friend. Concerned citizen, huh? Come on, it's lunchtime. We gotta go. <laughs> girl he admires. Did he tell you who? Mariah. Mariah Sparrow? That proud and arrogant girl? You should have opened up to him right there. He just likes me as a friend and nothing else. That's what he said. I mean, I know you guys have been friends for a long time now, but don't worry, Sunita. That was meant for you will always be. It's only time. Patient is virtual. I don't know what he sees in her that blinds his eyes from me. Mm -hmm. Maybe he thinks she's pretty and rich. I mean, she's beautiful from the outside, but the inside, she's horrible. Girl, you need a drink. So you guys, um, when the girl comes out here, you guys gonna see the girl. She's the girl of my life and I really love her. She's so pretty. Really? You guys seen her. She always come over here Dude, to see her. Congratulations. Right. Yeah, I know. You guys seen how you like her. She's a very beautiful girl. Okay. She's gonna come soon, man. That's, the girl. That's the girl of my life. Sunita, I thought Sunita was the girl. That's right. What's what happening? Sunita is so just a friend of mine. We are reading partner. Friend. I read uh, we don't uh, We're friends. We don't have means... anything in common. Oh, I mean, no, that's no, just no, a, no, just a friend. Me, I'm sorry. She's That's the girl that I really want in my life. Congratulations, okay. you, you deserve to be yeah. happy. Look, look at how they are here. Look at them, they're coming. Ooh, look at my girl, man. Which oh, one? Right, right, one right, right. The one with the thing? That's the pink. Mariah. Yep, that's my girl. You Ooh. better keep your eyes off of Mariah. That's my girl. What? That's an owner a long time. What? Yeah. Yeah. Mariah, yeah. hold on. You I guys... brought you guys out here to see my girl. Now you guys are and your girl, girl just so happens to be the love of my life. Who are those guys over there? Oh, it's one of those boys from school. They've been staring at us this whole time. They're going around chasing girls. Look, you guys are living in a dream world, though. You better, you so better we are all there. fighting over the same girl. We're not fighting over any girl. She is mine. I brought you guys here to see my girl. Now you guys are fighting over it. Let's settle this for you know. How would that be? How would that be? Whoever can go over there and get Mariah's love gets a thousand dollars. 
That's how you hear that. You guys are so That's full of yourself. That's a good deal, but I guess you guys gonna lose. After I win, I'm gonna take her on a date with his grand. How about that? Uh, he's already mine. Man. <laughs> and I'll me. save you both a lot of time. I'm gonna go over there right now. And... I, I'll be. I, I gotta go first. I like the deal. I, but think I gotta I go, should first. go first. No, I go first. Why shouldn't I go first? No, I should be the one to go first because I brought you guys out here and I know her. But she that's not me. fair because you have an unfair advantage. Okay, this is how we gonna do it. Let's not fight over this. Okay. Throw a coin. Fair. Head or tail? Can I pick? Give me head. Head? I'll take head. Tail. Head. Ah, uh, okay. First win of the day. Mm -hmm. But you're gonna fail, even if. So you go first. Go get it, man. Take your second. quarter. I'll enjoy my grand. <laughs> oh, they're coming to talk to you, Mariah. He better not, or I'll give him a piece of my mind. I trust you. Just take it easy on him. Hey, Mariah, can I talk to you, please? Who are you, and what is this about? I really, I really been wanting to tell you how I feel. Ah. Really, I just, I really care about you. Can I at least get a hug? Ah. Oh. Oh, anyway. I need to you really I need to leave right now. You need to go. Please. Mariah. Mariah. Oh, how's that feel, buddy? Oh, oh boy. He your boy, man. He can man, man, how's that man. feel? <laughs> Uh, oh man, that was a slap, bro. Let me I heard see, that let from me. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. Did you see how he insulted me? You're a beautiful girl, and you need to learn how to control that temper. Yes, but you really need to calm down. He approached you because you're beautiful, but you're a little ugly on the inside. You did not need to slap him. You could have just asked him to leave, but I did it for you. There's nothing wrong with me. I don't. I don't agree with either one of you. Can't get that guarantee. You can't get it. Guarantee you, know, you can't. Watch me do my yeah, thing. Hey, hey, yeah, hey! You gotta be careful. She's cold. Good <laughs> luck. <laughs> Let's see what's gonna happen. Did you see that? Damn! I think I died. Why do you? What did you say to her? They give me a slap, man. Here comes the second person. Again? It's like they're up to something. What's up? Mariah, can I have a word with you on that? Who are you and what is this about? Look, I know we don't know each other that well, but I see you around here all the time. And man, I don't want to sound crazy, but I think I'm in love with you. If you are so in love with me, I need you to prove it to me. Anything. I need you to kneel down. I need you to do five frog jumps. You want to win? You got to do what? Oh my. Those are frog jumps. Those are, they thought, they thought he was doing frog hog. Oh, he's crying. No, he didn't. If you think I'm just going to give you my heart, I want you to do a hundred push-ups, and then I will know you love me and I will give you my heart. <laughs> one, two, three, four. <laughs> you are not my type. Please don't ever come around here again. I don't want to see you face again. Oh, God. <laughs> I can't. Why did you make him do a? <laughs> Fell right into your trap with that one. Here comes the push-up brother. All that, the push -up, man, push -up. she is all yours, man. Push -up. Forget what about happened, her. Forget bro, about her, y'all. I told man, you guys, man. Why you have to do a push -up You're up, you'll be. You go see what you can do, man. man like forget that. <laughs> oh my God, he looks so <laughs> dumb. Sorry Ready. about that, man. Oh, man. Got it. Oh, so I All guess right. you keep your grand because none of us are getting it. All right, I'm going. See you. All right. Good. Let's see what he does. Well, that was bad. The third guy is coming. What's going on here? I wonder what he has to say. Hasn't he seen what his other two friends have gone through? Yet yeah, he's still coming. He's brave. This one looks cool and humble.
Good afternoon, beautiful ladies. Good, Good afternoon. afternoon. Hi, Mariah. Can I talk to you? What do you want? I'm sorry for the inconveniences my friends may have caused to you. I have a confession to make. Go on. My friends and I, we are all falling in love with you and we decided to bet whoever that wins your heart will win $1,000. And I know the first guy came in and fell, the second one fell, and I know I'm not going to make it, but I have a deal. Go on. I'm listening. Yeah, if you can pretend as if you love me, you have given me your heart that I want so I can get the money, I will share it with you 50-50. Wow. wow. Sounds like a good okay. deal. Okay. How are we going to do this? You just get up, give a hug, and do as you've given me your heart. We just walk toward that way so they can see. We'll watch your stuff. Oh, you got a phone in her hand? What's that? Dude, the phone out. You, you really got a number? Yeah, got a number too? I think you got sick. Man. You did the one. What a yo. Jumping you, around like a fool. Like a clown. Dude, how, this guy. What'd he do? This guy got a number. This is all. That's not even right. Yeah. That's not right. Hopefully we can get some of that money. <laughs> oh, here she comes. Thank you so much. Bye. See you later. Nice meeting you. Drinks are on me. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> exactly. She got out of here. Did you see the guy, though? The one that did the frog jump? <laughs> that was hilarious. I can't believe you made him do that. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> For the first one that she just slapped. Oh, he deserved it. I don't know. Not that much, <laughs> but. <laughs> he deserves something though. <laughs> but I like the last one because, well, <laughs> drinks are on you. Yeah, you two man. must, must have been in cahoots. I told her, you she just saw me and said, oh, you'll be my love. I don't I told you guys that she's gonna love me. Because she knows me, she really knows me. No. I told you guys to back out. Water, now, man. you lose the one thousand dollars, and you also lose the girl. See that? You guys are my friends, but I see I need to You're cash acting it. completely yeah. different. Because I don't know what you guys went and talked about. Because I just went to cry. you. How did have... that work? What did you do? You don't need to know about that. But if you want to know what I told her, you can have her. I will let you have her. Let her have her. But I won. You, I told you, you guys. You were in cahoots. <laughs> You too, so you guys, how do I get the money? So it all went good? And you're gonna go out? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Well, did you discuss where? Yeah. He said okay. he's gonna call me. Okay. Well, make sure you send those details to me. Well, Because I'm coming. <laughs> but I got slapped. He looks like an idiot and you came hey, out on top, hey. huh? Hi, Mariah. Hi, Yubi. How are you? I'm good. I'm wondering if you are available. I have the 50% of your share. Oh, wonderful. Do you know where we can meet? Um, you know, Yubam Kitchen? Uh, Yubam Kitchen. Yes, I know the place. What time do you want us to meet? How about 1 o'clock? 1 o'clock. That's cool. Okay. Uh, I'll see you soon by 1 o'clock. See you soon. All right, bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> it was real. Morning, Sulita. It's a good time to go out for jogging. Yeah, so how was the party? Oh yeah, the party was good. We had fun. It went well. Nice. 
Come on, let's go running together. It'll be fun. Join me. Oh, I wish I could, but I have somewhere to go. Really? Where are you off to? I want to go see Mariah. Hurry up. She's missing you. Bye. This is so nice. I'm so glad we're doing this. Yeah, have you been to this place before? Yeah, once before. It was really good. Really? Thank you. Yeah, my friends really love it too. It's just such a nice place. Yeah, I can't wait mm -hmm. to see what they oh! oh! All right. Oh! I can't wait to see what they're doing. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, my God. You can see my shoes! This is your first day? It's not the thing of all. It's okay. Sorry about that. It's sorry about that. It's an accident. You shouldn't have bought it. But that's inexcusable. I know, but I'm so sorry about that. It's okay. It's okay. We can clean that up. That's a bit. Sorry about that. Okay. Oh. Getting her, but let me just get the money. <laughs> we want to talk like you. You're only gonna teach us how to talk and win beautiful girls. And I was like, it's okay. I will teach you guys. Well, you know. <laughs> but I first of all tell them, hey, where is my cash? I need the one thousand dollars. Thank you so much for accepting the deal. So meanwhile, why did you treat my friends like that? First guy came in, you give him a slap. The second guy, you have him to do a frog jump, do a push up, 100 push up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I was like, what? What is she gonna ask me to do? If she got these guys do a push up, do a frog jump, kneeling down, getting a slap, what am I gonna get? <laughs> if I didn't come with the deal, what was in your mind? What will you have me done? Oh gosh, it was something humiliating. That was mean. <laughs> oh well, anyways. <laughs> like a really trusting and reliable guy. Oh, wow. I thought he was gonna take the money and play us and his friend. So did I. He really seems like a nice guy. He was serious. We met at Ebom Kitchen and he gave me 50% of the money. He's really sincere, humble, and just a smart, great guy. And that's why I really like him. You know what, you're right. And I think I'm really falling for him. Wait, are you serious? You didn't tell him this yet, did you? I did. I couldn't hold it in, and he was so happy. I thought you guys were just pretending. Wait, was that a part of the deal? Love comes to those who believe in it. Yeah, now that you're in love, I hope you'll self-reflect and be kind, because no one wants anyone with that attitude. I don't want to hear about it. You guys are insulting me. What? what? OK, whatever. All right, we're here to have a good time. So let's party! All right. <laughs> Thank Here you. you. Oops. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> hey, baby. How are you? Good, how are you? Come on in. So, how was your day? It was great. Here, come take a seat. Let me just get ready. Uh, I don't think this is dressy enough. Um, yeah, you might want a good change. Okay, yeah. All right. Take a seat, honey. All right. Okay. Uh, 
I'm all ready. Oh my God. What do you think? Ooh, you're so pretty, beautiful. Yeah? Aww. I'm ready. Where are we going? Somewhere special. Oh good, let me get my purse. Okay. It's gonna be a fun day, okay? Hi, how are you? I'm good. Do you know the lady that gave you these? No, she just she just gave me these things. What about the other one that pushed you down? <sighs> uh, she's no good. Beautiful outside, but terrible in here. Baby, what are you doing here? Hey, Yubong, how are you? I'm doing nothing. Hi, Sunita. It's nice to see you. Thank you so much for what you did to that old lady. At least you didn't push her down like other people. Are you going now? Or oh, you need a ride? Sure. Right, let me give yeah. You a ride. <laughs> What are you doing? Where are you going? But you pushed the homeless person on the floor, I, though. I had to pick her up from the ground. What's oh wrong with God. you? Oh, my God! Calm down. Calm right. down. Is she more beautiful than me? You know you're the cause of your own problems, right? What? Don't talk to me like that! Yeah, several times I have told you, you have to stop looking down on people. That kindness is a virtue. Oh, I didn't deserve this! Beauty is not only in our looks, but it's also in our hearts. Yeah, you have to look with it and let it pour out. What you do? Oh, okay. Someone better will come. Someone better. <laughs> good day, sir. Uh, good day. How are you? Thank you, sir. Because I wanted to look at this. Uh -huh. Oh, I'm from the US. You need to come back here. 
Vegas here. Thank you. All right, Kaylin. Hey, bro, how you doing? Yeah. What's wrong with you? You're, you're not sounding good. What's the problem? Yeah, I'm just calling you to tell you about her. I mean, attitude, it's very unbearable. I mean, I won't be able to withstand such any longer. I don't understand. What has she done wrong? She keep embarrassing me each time we go out, uh, each time we go to places, she yell at people, she's jealous, she slap one lady push her down at the supermarket and the other one she yeah like the other day at the restaurant she bought a guy a waiter water said the other guy did a mistake spilling water on the table. Even me when I'm trying to advise her to change her attitude, to change her lifestyle, like she keeps yelling at me too. I talk to her friends and friends says they've been talking about her you know, lifestyle so I don't think um, I'm always embarrassed each time we go out with her. I'm even afraid to go out with her anymore because she's gonna pull up her attitude somewhere. You be, I told you about this girl and her beauty. But you wouldn't listen to me. You can't just go after a girl because of her beauty. Beauty is a tell of the attitude of the person. Beauty is beyond everyday makeups, eyelashes, dresses, beautiful bags, spoken words and all that. The heart is a true beauty of life. I'm just done. I'm done. I'm just done with her. That's what I'm calling you to take you know now. Okay. Now look at this. Sunita is a beautiful girl and a good girl and she loves you. Would you keep rejecting her? Yeah. Yeah, I might as well go back to Sunita. I guess I have no choice now. Now that my eyes are open, so. Now that your eyes are open, I want to advise you. Go after Sunita before it's too late. That's my advice for you. Okay. I'll keep you posted, bro. Wish you luck. Check it I'm so glad to have you. I wonder what blinds my eye that I couldn't see how good you are. I mean, I was just following the beauty of Mariah. Yeah, uh, I didn't want to force to you to like me. So I know my time will come and I'm glad you saw us for who we are. You have a very good heart. How come I didn't see all this? I mean, I was so amazed with your kind gesture towards that homeless lady. You just came out and give us talk like that. I mean, that was very good of you. When I look at it, I'm like... I had faith in you. I just know that I have to be patient. So I want to say, first of all, I'm so sorry for not knowing what God kept for me. No, I'm sorry. I know times will come, you know, we just have to be patient, so don't be sorry. You are the best gift I've ever seen in my life. Thank you so much for accepting me. This is destined by God. You know, I love you too, and I'm glad this really worked out, and I'm so happy. It was as a result of what you did the other day. How could you do that disrespect to that boy? That doesn't mean you should embarrass me. No, I thought you've changed all this while I've been talking to you. I mean, advising you to change your lifestyle. But see, I'm not ready to put up with someone like that. I found someone dearest to my heart. And that is where my heart belongs. It's with her, isn't it? 
I'm in the office right now and I have a lot of things to catch up. I gotta go now. Hello? Hello? I really love you and thank you so much for accepting me. Yeah, I'm really happy that you finally opened your eyes and saw me. I don't know, I was so blind, but... Thank you so much for coming into my life. Oh, look at that bird. It's so beautiful. I hear it, but I can't see it. Yubi? Sunita, please, will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> yes. talk to you in private? Can't you see I'm busy right now? I can't believe this. It's fine. Go and listen to what she has to say. Are you sure about this? Yes. Okay. Excuse me. her and leave me over a little mistake is this what you wanted to tell me about in private i don't think you have anything to say no i have more to say to you i love you i'm so sorry i got someone else already and i don't want to put up with someone with an attitude look you are a beautiful girl and you have other guys here looking for a beautiful girl like you I think it's all over between two of us. You're gonna pay for this. Sorry. Is everything okay? Um, everything is fine. She just wanted me back. Really? What did you say? I told her my heart belongs to someone else. Where does your heart belong? To Sunita, my love. Come on, let's leave this place now. <laughs> Happy birthday, my love. Oh, thanks, Yubi. How was your night? You... I, I had a dream about us. Oh, really? What happened in the dream, was I? You and I ran an island or something. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, I can't wait for that. That's a surprise. Meanwhile, I have something special outside for you. What? Yeah. yeah. It's something special and you don't have to see with the naked eyes. So you okay. have to close your eyes. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, give me one moment. Okay.
Yubi. This car is mine. Happy birthday. Oh, it's a beautiful car. You wanna go in? Yeah. Oh my god. I cannot believe this. Sunita, how was your college? You had a good travel and everything? Yeah, really good. Betty, I'm very proud of you for your success in the college. Thank you for your support, Papa. Sunita, now that you have a college degree, I think it's the right time to get you married to Prince Adesh. Who is Prince Adesh? He is King Nemon's son. Your mother and I made the decision to get you married. He loves you and when you meet him, you will love him too. We both have never met or know anything about each other. How can we fall in love? He loves you and when you meet him, you will love him too. Papa, at this era, are we still doing arranged marriage? Well, Sunita, we have to follow the tradition and I am the custodian of the law of this kingdom. You know that. I already fell in love with someone and I'm engaged. I cannot marry Prince Adish because I don't even know him. You cannot marry someone outside our tradition. Besides, he must be from a royal family. This person you said you love or engage, is he from a royal family or a prince? Papa, please permit me to bring him. Love me for introduction. Um, Sunita, I'm so sorry. I have a busy day at work. I miss your calls, so... That's but... okay. I was just missing you. Please don't work so hard. You know, I just came back last night from India and I have to go into work this morning for meetings. I was just missing you, but how was your flight? Not okay. It was boring since you were not there with me. Oh, I'm sorry about that, but um, you arrived safely. So that what matters. Um, the, what about your parents? They're doing good. I mean, they were happy to see me. And 
And meanwhile, I told them I met the right person, I found love, and we're engaged. Wow. So what was their response? They asked to bring you for introduction. Oh, such great news. So when are we going? Saturday the 13th. Um, the next two weeks or so? Oh, that would be cool. Yeah, I can't wait for you to meet them. Me too. I would like to be in India. I've never been to India before, so that would be a pleasure. Saturday the 13th. Uh... I'm so excited. Okay, so we're gonna prepare and then... Sunita, you never told me you were a princess all this while. I just wanted you to like me for who I am. But, I mean, at least to you, shh. <laughs> Majesty is waiting. We'll talk about this later. Okay. Your Highness. Mother, father, this is my fiance, Yubi. Morning, your majesties. What is this? Why are you both ignoring him? God, it's Kolleja. No, you can't do this. Papa, what's going on? You cannot marry my daughter. You're not a prince. You're not from royalty. And you're from Africa. I don't want you to be with my daughter ever again. Understand? Mother, you're not saying anything. Sunita, I'm disappointed in you. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. It's obvious that they don't like me because I'm an African man. I'm a black man for that matter. So, I mean, I think it's over between us. It's my life. I choose to be with who I want to be with, not who they want me to be with. And I choose you. 
that is final. Like your king, your majesty rightly said that we are wasting our time. Oh, I don't know. You have a husband. They want you to marry the prince. I'm not a royalty, so... Sorry, it's over. Sunita, what is wrong with you? I sent you to school to learn not to come back with an African man. That man is who I love and we've been together for years. At least you shouldn't have embarrassed him that way. I don't like it. How dare you talk to me in that matter? Sunita, apologize to your father right now. After you apologize to me and Mayubi. Sunita, what has come over you, Sunita? Sunita, your father and I are looking out for the best interest for you. We found a perfect match for you. Why will you arrange someone for me at this era? I'm not a baby mother. That's the tradition, Sunita. And you will not marry Yubi. You will marry who we choose for you. His name is Adesh. He's very rich and very handsome too, Sunita. Mother, are you serious? Sunita. You know our tradition. We cannot marry outside. I am the keeper of the law and you will never get my consent. This is insane. Sunita, Adesh is a prince and he's the heir to the throne and he will be the king once. And then you will be the queen. It took us many years to find him. Adesh really loves you, Sunita. This is my life. I should be the one to choose who I want to be with, not you or father. And how does he love me when he's never met me before? Sunita, he will keep you very happy and you will make a perfect couple. Sunita, you are welcoming your husband tomorrow. You will be prepared to welcome him. My husband, Yubi? No, Prince Adish. I will never marry him. I love Yubi and that is final. Sunita, if you disobey my order, I will disown you. Sunita, we have a visitor for you in the living room. I don't recall inviting anyone. Who will that be? Is it Yubi? It is Prince Adish, your husband. Don't make him wait. Okay? Are you looking for someone? Is that the way you welcome your husband? Don't you know I'm a prince? You should kneel and welcome your prince. Are you out of your mind? Remember, this is my house. You insult me again, I'll throw you out. What is going on here? Sunita, why will you talk to your husband like that? Don't you know he is a prince? Apologize to your husband right now. Would you call him my husband? Who will ever want to marry an arrogant and insulting kid like him? He has no respect for women and he's too proud of himself. Sunita, stop it. Sunita, next time when you talk to him in such a manner, I will unleash my anger on you. Please go ahead. I will never marry this boy. I love you, B, and that's final. Oh my God, what is gone over you, Sunita? You father and this boy is what is wrong with me. 
I will not stand here and take any more insult from this low life again.
Hey, Yubi. Hi, Helen. How are you? I'm good. How are you? What about Sunita? I've been trying calling her phone, but she is not answering. Uh, it's everything okay? I'm trying to figure out what's going on with her. Ever since she came, like, it's been a couple of days already. All she does is sleep all day, crying all day. She don't want to even eat. I try to give her something. I give her something to drink just to stay hydrated and she's still like, I'm worried. I'm very worried about her. Okay, can I can I speak with her now? Um, she's sleeping. I'm not sure she's gonna even pick up. I don't wanna wake her up. Like she looked it so down. She's frustrated. She don't wanna talk to me. I really don't know what to do anymore. Okay, I will come over there and talk to her. Don't worry. Um, thank you so much for the information. All right. Bye. Bye. Can I see Sunita? Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. She's been crying. She's not eating. I don't know what's wrong with her. She don't know, She don't even want to talk to me. So, I think you should just leave. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, Yubi. When she's up, um, I'll let her know that I came. I will. I'll let her know. Right. I'm sorry, Yubi. It's okay. Coffee. So you're not gonna talk to me? Like, what's wrong? You became. You here? Well, I sent him away. <sighs> Why would you do that? I don't know. I mean, you're not talking to anybody. I would have thought that you don't want to speak to anybody. Sunita, like, I, I didn't know, like... You need to talk to me. I didn't know you wanted to talk to him. You're not talking to anybody. You're not even talking to me. I, I didn't know if you wanted to talk to him. Sunita, this is what I'm talking about. Like, talk to me. I don't know you wanted to talk to him.
You be? You be? You be? Uh, are you okay? Sunita. What are you doing? I heard you came to see me, but what are you doing? Thought I lost you forever. What are you drinking? What is this? Are you trying to kill yourself? But I can't get a hold of you anymore and I came in, your friend told me that you don't want to see me and I mean, I'm, oh my god, happy to see you. So you're back? I'm so sorry about my father and mom. They're... I apologize. I'm so sorry for what happened. That's okay, that's a bygone for now. I'm fine with it. Now it's for us to team up together and see how we can conquer this battle. And I strongly believe that you and I were destined to be together. Kindly forgive me for the wrong things that I said that day. Um, I was so flabbergasted when that happened. But um, I didn't know what comes into me. But um, I, I love you, Yubi. Don't worry about it. So, are you ready for this reunion? Yes, I am. I'm all out to make sure I do all I could to love you. Miatum say Priya. I love you too. What is he doing here, Sunita? What is this, Sunita? Father, please. We love each other so much and we'll make a good couple. Please give us your consent. Prince Adish is arrogant and he's not a good match for me. No matter how arrogant and rude Adish is, you will marry him. That is my order. And maybe you will be the one to change him. I'm old enough to know what is not good for me. I will not marry that boy except to be. I love you, B, and that is final. Sunita, if you do not marry Adish, you will cease to be my daughter and the princess from henceforth. You decide now, Adish or Yubi. I love you, B. Take the crown away from her. In Dono Kaleja. Why will you take such decision? Leaving the castle, uh, your kingdom, just simply because of a man? That man is where my heart belongs, so I want to follow. Oh, thank you so much for trusting in me. Thank you for loving me, and I'm ready to love you, and I will fight for you till the end. Sunita!
तैयारी कैसी है हाँ हाँ सारे भेज दिए हैं। लोग हाँ भेजा करीब पाँच हजार लोग आने वाले हैं। अच्छा हाँ अरे क्या हुआ Doctor, how is my husband now? Oh, my Majesty, come, let's talk in my office. My Queen, the King has been diagnosed with a kidney disorder for IgA, for which we would need to do a kidney transplant as soon as possible. What causes this IgA? IgA is a deficiency that is caused by the developmental abnormalities in the white blood cells of the body, which is often due to the genetic deviations. The IgA nephrotherapy is then, you know, the white blood cells that fight the infections, they actually start depositing in the kidney over the years. We need a donor, and the donor kidney must be an exact match with the king before we proceed. Please take my kidney, doctor. Do whatever it takes to save my king. <laughs> we have to run some tests and see if you are a match before we can proceed. Am I his match? I'm sorry, my queen. You are not his match. We have tested all the 17 members of the family and no one matches the king. We need to find the donor. We need to hurry. क्या हो गया हमारे राज्य को आपकी जरूरत है आप <laughs> हमारे राज्य को आपकी जरूरत है आप समझते क्यों नहीं हो मैं क्या करूं कुछ समझ में नहीं आ रहा है मुझे तो Hello? Hello, Sunita? Mom? It's your mother calling you. Sunita? Forget about the past. Your father really needs you. Now, he needs a match for a kidney transplant, Sunita. Immediately, you know. Yeah, we're coming down. Don't bring that African man along. Mom, I cannot leave him. I cannot live without him, just like how you cannot live without my father, your husband. <sighs> All right. You can bring him along. But please hurry up, Sunita. Please. Okay. What's wrong? My mom called. Really? Yeah, my dad is not feeling well. He has kidney failure and he needs a new kidney transplant now. Oh no. That means we need to go there and see how we can help. Yeah, we have to go as soon as possible. I'm so sorry about that. Don't worry, everything would be fine, okay? Yeah. Sunita bhi aa gayi hai ab to. Doctors koshish kar rahe hain jaldi se kidney match mil hi jayega. 
बस अपना ध्यान रखो और मैं अपने राज्य को संभाल रही हूँ नर्स आई एम हियर टू मीट माई मदर क्वीन कैन यू लेट डॉक्टर श्रुति नो आई एम हियर आई थॉट यू वर बैनिश फ्रॉम द किंगडम ये वी नो बट वी हेयर टू सेव द किंग एंड वी वॉन्ट टू सी हर शी एक्स फॉर अस द कॉम कैन यू जस्ट लेट आर नो प्लीज या ओके लेट्स हैव अ सी योर माजेस्टी सुन इता How is he doing? He's getting worse. I'm sorry, Your Majesty, for the news. Thank you so much. Now we need to do some lab test. Madhusuri. Hospital. Okay, just give me one sec. How are you? Yeah, let's go upstairs to see the oh, doctor. Okay. I am sorry Sunita you are not the match I will like to be tested Sorry. I hope you feel better soon. Your Majesty, the doctor will be here shortly. Okay. Thank you. Congratulations your majesty. You be has the perfect match with the king. Thank you so much my son. It's my pleasure your majesty. Can I talk to you? I won't let you do this. He never liked you. I know he's your father and we have to save his life. I don't want to lose you. My king is dying. Thank you for doing this. My son.
Doctor, how was the surgery? The surgery went really well. The king is good. And Yubi is doing fine as well. Can I see Yubi? And can I see the king, please? Not right now. They are in the recovery. I'm so happy you're all right. Well, thank you very much. So grateful to Don't you. Don't thank me. Thank your daughter, Sunita. I'm sorry for all my wrong actions. I love you very much and wish you the best. Thank you for donating your kidney to save my life. Father, I'm not the one. It was Yubi's kidney that mashed yours. Really? Where is Yubi? I want him right now here. Okay. Good day, Your Majesty. How are you feeling? I'm doing great, Yubi. Thanks to you. You're welcome, Your Majesty. You did this for me after what I did to you? Yes, Your Majesty. The wall is a global village, and we all have to come together to build to save our life. Where are your parents, Yubi? My mom is fine, but my father is gone. It happens when he try to save a stranger's life from the assassins and the assassins gun him down. What happened? It happens while we were at the farm. A stranger ran into our farm and my father tried to hide him. But the guys came and interrogated my father and he denied ever seeing him. While he was wasting their time, the stranger had escaped but so sudden, one of the killers had spotted the stranger running. So they were upset that my father was lying to them and they shot him dead. And I was six years old when that happened. Yubi, I am the stranger, your father who saved. You were that little boy? Uh, I... Yes, Your Majesty. I tried to find your father, and I heard he was killed, and you all moved out of place. I give my consent. You can marry my daughter. Your father saved me then, you save me now. I give my consent. I give my consent.